Da ante, da ante, da ante. R.I.P. to your money. Nicola here says that she loves you, but you're not her only sugar, are you? Huh. Well, there's a lot going on in this thumbnail, okay? I love you, Zaddy, but you're not my only sugar. Yeah, because Nicole, double L, has some stuff up her sleeve. Now, if you look at this thumbnail, this is very interesting. They're standing in front of the garden of her mom, of Nicole's mom. And um, either this is shot during Halloween, and that's why we see a coffin standing in the background, okay? We have here a, a sign board thingamajiggy that says witchy ways. And later on, you'll see that there's a few skulls and this and that. Either they get down like this, because some people do have weird stuff in their garden, or it's Halloween, which means they actually shot this a long period logically time ago. Um, which also gives us hope because that means maybe, hopefully, more seasons are coming and they're already filming it as we speak. Um, they do film these way, way, way in advance. But in any case, um, this might be a sign also. That's the third option that this might be a sign that he needs to run because it's going to be R.I.P. to the dough he used to see. Them days are over to his money. Like his money is going to burn. It's going to go. She's going to squander it. She's going to smash it. She's going to use it all and leave him high and dry. Okay. And witchy way might be an indication of her witchy ways, which he's going to find out very soon when he finds out, Ooh, you're not her only sugar daddy. Okay. She's got more stuff up her sleeve. So in any case, let's look into all that. <laughs> Cue the intro. It's time for love after luck up, baby. Hi. Let's just get right on into it. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So they finished all their wine drinking in front of the prison and everything. And now they're finally headed somewhere. That is not the premises of the prison. The auntie's dropping me off at my mom's. Just look in the bag and see what else I got for you. This whole yeah, bag. so many gifts. Gifts on gifts on gifts on gifts. Look at all these watches. Um, yes, plural. Watches. Okay? Some people don't even have a watch. Okay? Your phone is your watch. Okay? We, your phone. Use your phone. He got her a phone, but then got her watches. Not a watch. Watches. Multiple. I, I don't know. Maybe. Do you even know if she likes to wear watches? Like, at this point, they're just buying stuff just to buy oh, stuff. I know that was expensive. And that's also an interesting thing to say. When you get a gift, I don't care who he's from. They, uh, oh, I know that was expensive. Looking at him, trying to see mm, how much is this. Let me see if I can sell this stuff on that. On a, I don't know where you sell stuff. Oh, yeah. Interesting. yeah. Money ain't no object when it come to you. Money ain't no object when it come to you. That's what I like to hear. What is this? You, know that? you got me lingerie. Oh, yeah. But what? Of course. Of course. The way it is now. These guys are getting all this stuff and they want something in return. It's not for free. They want something in return. That's how these guys' minds work. Stan is talking about the same stuff. He's going to lavish her with everything. And all they talk about is doing the tantantana because that is, is an exchange. And if you didn't know, now you know. You can look, but you can't touch. Just gotta so she's like, you can look, but you can't touch. He, she doesn't want all that, right? She's gonna explain why. She just got out of prison. prison. And I don't want to be touched all over. I have not been touched in four years. That makes me uncomfortable. You haven't been touched in four years? No, I haven't. You haven't been touched in four years? No, I have No. The way, hmm. the way she, you can tell from her body language, bogus, okay? She's like, uh, what did she do? Just like, no, I have it. Like, I don't know. It's the way she blinked her eyes. It's the way she blinked her eyes. She was like, no, I haven't. It, hmm. She's lying. Obviously, she's lying. By nobody. And he's like, by nobody. And she's like, by nobody. I'm telling you, she's lying. He's about to figure out a whole bunch of stuff. As long as you give it back. Of course the money then he goes to smell it this guy let me tell you something let me see my tea for a second mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah let me tell you something about the auntie okay one thing about him is this this guy has not held money like that probably ever probably ever there is no millionaire billionaire who has a stack of money unless it's for a video uh, shoot or whatever the way is just the way that he held the money and he was like 
Mm, I smell good. That's a lot of money. Mm, that, that smells real good. Let me just savor the moment. Because I won't be holding a stack like this for a long time. It's crazy. Let's go meet and everything. Um, I need to see that again. Let's go meet and and the way he looks at it, he's like, mm. it's just even a weird thing to do. <laughs> this guy's getting high off, <laughs> off of sniffing the money. Let's go. That's crazy. Meet her let's go meet her and everything. Right? He's ready to meet his in law. Like, well, let's go. He drops her off at the mom and he's like, he's ready to go. Um, I think I'm just going to go in here. Skirt, you stay right here. I'm going to take my gifts and bounce. Come on, so. So, well, hold on, what now? I want you to meet my mom eventually. I want, when you meet my mom, I want it to be special. Yeah, you gonna meet that mom when y'all reach heaven. Um, That's gonna be real special because she does not want you meeting that mom. <laughs> she does not want you meeting that mom at all. You're just a cash cow. Why would she want her mom to meet somebody that has no significance? I'm saying all this, but I've seen the preview, so I know that he does meet the mom eventually, but yeah. Yeah, I'm just joking around, but to be honest, like it's crazy. It's crazy, but at the same time, you know what's really crazy? Give her that time with her mom. She hasn't seen the mom in four years. It's four years, right? Let's let's just go back and see. Let's go back and see. Yeah, it's been four years for larceny. That's a law. That's a law, you know. Hey, mom. Mom, eventually, I want when you meet my mom, I want it to be special. And that means a lot to me still. What means a lot to him still is the fact that he was the one to pick her up and do all these theatrics with the wine glasses and all the rest of it, right? With the wine and everything. So that still means something. And he's very, he feels very honored that he was the first one to go and pick her up anyway. So that is kind of cool. That's kind of cool that he's not too bothered because he shouldn't be. Because she should really spend time with her family right now, which you are not yet. All right, baby. I'll see you tomorrow. <coughs> you promise? Mm hmm Okay. I mean, she's wanting them kisses. Like, she's just leaning in and everything. So she seems more affectionate than some of these guys, you know? I love you. I love you, too. All right. She's doing all that so that mm, he can savor them kisses. And then next thing she knows, oh, she'll come back and there'll be a, a, a Ferrari or some kind of car waiting for her. Because, you know, he's going to lay, he has to lay it on thick. He has to keep on lavishing her with the gifts and the gifts and the more gifts and the more gifts and the more gifts. So that maybe eventually he'll get them cookies. Yeah. Bye. Bye. So a few things to note as she walks to the door, the whole entire tag is just there. I don't know if you buy something for somebody like that, wouldn't you just take the tag and it's like, look, if it doesn't fit or you don't like it or whatever, or it's malfunctioning, it's not working, it's broken, it's torn, it's whatever. Then we can take it back to the shop. Um, but I'm going to keep the receipts in the meantime for a bit because it's a gift, right? Who on earth gives a gift? I don't care who you're giving it to. Who on earth gives a gift and then gifts, gifts, whoa, gifts, that's very hard to say. Gifts the gift with the receipt just attached to it like that. I don't know. Maybe that's how they get down. I don't know. And then we see another thing. Yeah, those are, those are like the RIP things. Look, it's like, you see that? Yeah, right there. Right there. Yeah, you, you might as well hold your head. You might as well scratch your head because this is weird, wild. But I'm sure it's Halloween. I'm pretty sure it's Halloween. It must be Halloween. But yeah, they have like tombstones. That's the, that's the word. That's what they have in there. It's very interesting. I had to see that a few times because that's pretty strange, all these things. Mm. Wow, just, just look at her. She's coming home like it, it, she's been to, like, like she, she's, she's just had a Christmas party. Look at her. Even, I think there's even shoes. In boxes wow and I wonder what her mom is gonna say like yo how did you and how and where did you get this or sometimes I think maybe the family is very much aware of their tricking ways <laughs> I did not talk to my mom because I was too busy again so this is her with the mom way back when and yeah I don't know about y'all but you know if your mom is like out here sticking the tongue out tongue piercing in there and everything taking a selfie <laughs> <laughs> it, it's a different type of relationship you're gonna have you know you're gonna be she's trying to get down she's trying to like okay let me just say for instance like let's say britney's mom i wouldn't expect her to to be doing this or even um rachel's mom you know 
Rachel from Rachel and Doug. I wouldn't expect her to do that. They're all like cute, cute moms and they're very, they're very proper kind of, so to say. Um, that's why their, their daughters are living a good, like Rachel is an engineer. Brittany is, I don't know what she's doing, but she's rich. So they're, you know, cause their moms are very proper and prim. They want the best for their child. Da, 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 da. That's probably why they didn't end up in prison. But then now somehow they've ended up dating somebody who was in prison. But this mom looks wild. Kid turned out wild. The whole situation is wild. Everything is just wild. I mean, you can't really judge a picture and just be like, okay, they're wild or whatever. But I do think it was like that. You know, mom looks kind of young. And um, yeah, might have been one of those loose type of parenting, you know? You never know. Just speculating here. But that's what I, see. I did not talk to my mom because I was too busy getting high and, and me and her were fighting. Oh my God, he has pink hair. Hmm. <laughs> they're having all this conversation and the auntie's just in the car like wow must be nice pink hair <laughs> and then i got put behind bars and she literally moved from indiana to virginia just so she could come visit me that's really nice that's what mommies do setting up a wedding and everything he's already thinking about the wedding and everything okay and get married they, 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 they want all that, but they don't even know anything. So, this this is... So, hmm. The mother doesn't live far. You're literally in the same... Yeah, I think so. I didn't think... I don't think the auntie had to travel really far to get... To to pick her up and to go to the mom's house, right? So, you live in the same... Whatever. Vicinity. And... You, you've never met the mom. You don't know her family. You don't know anything about her, really. But you're talking about marriage this is what i don't understand but in any case she's out here texting mandem and she says hey i'm out finally i miss you when can i see you bae you're you out for real is what the person says so she has a there's date. a few things who's not the on type that i haven't told beyonce wow i want to see you soon but what are you up to this you know morning? just got out of prison i'm not married like i have a lot of life i'm gonna hit you up when i know I don't know. The thing that I thought was so weird about this is like, okay, but I don't see any previous conversations. Like sometimes they would have it and they would blur it or something like that. Um, I remember when I zoomed in on uh, Andrea, her daughter, whatever her name is, Nyla, I think it's Nyla, and uh, Andrea's man, whatever his name is again, from the last season. And you could see previous conversations. And I was like, ooh, and I was reading them to y'all. Um, in this case, there's no previous anything like who is even this person or is she somebody who deletes all her messages? That's also very possible because next thing you know, Dante is snooping through your phone. You never know. Or is this a paid actor and the whole thing is fake? <laughs> I don't know because they always want, they need a storyline. They, they can't just have an inmate who is level-headed like Brittany from last season with Maurice. Uh, is it that guy's name? Maurice? Marcelino. Yes. And um, who is level-headed and comes out and it's like, He's just, just a normal person. Just a cool person. Um, I'm talking about Brittany from last season. Just level-headed and really about her business and pops out and babies and lives her normal life. Although I'm saying that, but she did start off. She was in a relationship with another woman, wasn't she, in the beginning? So yeah, I think this that's what prison does. When you come out, you just want to do whatever. She's been in for four years, so she wants to experience life. Like she said herself, she's not married. And that's what's going to withhold. Like this is what's going to hold some of these people back from getting married. As people on the outside, it's like, oh, I want to get married, this and that. And they're already walking through shops and looking at things that would be nice for the wedding. And their mind's all wedding, wedding, wedding. The person inside is like, I'm going to come out, have a few secrets, and do a little bit of fun stuff and live my life because I'm free, you know? So it's completely two different worlds. And they're never actually, if you look at it, now that I've even brought up the Britney situation, they come out never really being on the same wavelength as the person who was in the free world, like at all. I to live and I mean... Just trying to have a little fun. So this is where you could tell editing is funny. Now she puts the light off as if she's going to sleep. But who on earth goes to sleep with the towel on their head and cold, wet hair? Who? This is so fake. This is just for TV. Oh, yeah, she's going to bed now. She's not going to bed. They told her, oh, just, you know, put the, the, the light off and then we'll keep filming you. And then she's going to get up again and 
maybe dry blow dry her hair or do whatever with her hair <laughs> i'm just trying to show you these things these little things that i noticed about editing because i realized that the editing is heavy sometimes there's even a conversation and they'll just switch like the, the sequence of the conversation which i don't know why you would do that i can get you no nah, I, I can't even get you taking a, uh, a clip from one other day let's say you take a clip from shooting on wednesday and then put that rather first instead of the one that you did on monday like i don't even get that because just show us the thing chronologically it makes more sense that way but you know they need to make it fancy you see that sleeping like that can't fool me in any case this one went on for quite a long time so i'm gonna leave it right there um, in any case, if you're not already part of the family, make sure you hit bomb stump as on to that subscribe button. Comment because I really want to know anything. Like because you obviously like this video and hit the notification bell. Why share it? I'll see you in the next video, which will be tomorrow. Daily is video videos up in here. In the meantime, make time for glorious life. It's time to start what? Let me try it. God bless. Da ante, da ante. Bye bye goes your money.